Welcome to Ubeda, Spain. This is in Andalusia province, and it's an old city. Let's check it out. It's fun to walk through the narrow streets of Ubeda and check out this old governmental building that's transformed now into a school. Ubeda is in the Jaén province, not to be confused with the city of Jaén, which is 10 kilometers south. You can go to the upper right hand corner and click on the video there to see my five minute video about Jaén. Ubeda is in the Jaén Provincia. It is a comunidad autónoma, which is an autonomous community, in Andalusia, which is in southern Spain. I just want you to know two different dates, and they're easy to remember. 7-Eleven, like the store in America, that's when the Arabs occupied the city in the year 7-Eleven. And the other one is easy also, it's one, two, three, four. That's when Ferdinand III of Castile reconquered Ubeda from the Arabs. And now it's time to eat food. This is an olive growing region, so you're gonna get more olive oil than you can imagine. And whether it's lunch or dinner, you are going to be amazed by the tapas. Tapas are these small little plates of food and they like to bury you in them. You can expect to spend about $5 per tapa. Andalusia looks great in the morning, in the daytime, and at night. Most of Ubeda is a national monument, and UNESCO declared the city as a World Heritage Site in 2003. The Church of Santa Maria de los Reales Alcazares de Ubeda sits on a sacred place built on top of the remains of a mosque. And we crashed a wedding party, which was fun. Ubeda is situated in a well-watered, olive-growing region. It produces olive oil and oil-pressing equipment. And now check out this old book. What's interesting about this book is that it was censored by the Inquisition. Mm. And we see it here in the back. Look at that. Huh. It's all scratched out, oh. right? <laughs> This is the library of El Palacio Vela de los Cobos. This stately manor was designed in 1551. And our tour guide, believe it or not, was the son of the owner of the palace. Yeah, that's right, they still live in this house. And they give tours. He's lived for decades in Houston, Texas, and his father lives in the house. But now that his dad is in his 90s, he plans to return to take care of the house. And now we'll end our tour with the Holy Funerary Chapel of El Salvador del Mundo because this is the symbol of Ubeda in Jaén province. It was designated as a historic artistic monument in 1931. 
I've made over a dozen videos about Spain, including where I hiked across Spain twice, once on El Camino de Santiago and the second time across El Pir Los Pyrenees. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos. Like and subscribe. Hit that like button. Smash it. Crush it. Do whatever you need to do. Share it. And I appreciate your support. Become a patron at patreon.com slash ftapon. This is Francis Tapon encouraging you to wander and learn. <laughs>